What's up, everybody? This is Wilson Alexander from The Advocate and Times-Picayune. First day of LSU football practice got underway today. John Emery was not there, the running back who had been out for the spring because of academic reasons. But Brian Kelly said today he is expected to be with the team tomorrow. Emery was finishing an internship. I um, mean, he has done everything that he has needed to do to regain his good standing with the team and be a part of this team this fall. That's great news for LSU, which has a lot of running backs already, but Emory brings an explosive element. You saw it against Alabama last year, against Auburn with touchdowns in those games where he was able to really make some explosive moves um, and get in the end zone. And now LSU to, is going to have a really deep rotation at running back. We saw a few of those guys today as well. Armani Goodwin, who has sustained a knee injury last year and was out for the spring as he recovered, he was a full participant, had a brace on that left knee, but running with the first team. We also saw Logan Diggs, a Notre Dame transfer for the first time. He had been getting over a hamstring injury, Brian Kelly said. So it's great to see him back out on the field. And then Trey Holly, Caleb Jackson, and Noah Kane also getting quite a bit of work um, as the running backs rotated through, and Emory will join them tomorrow. The main takeaway today was the wide receivers. This is a talented group, and they showed it in a lot of ways. Brian Thomas had a 60-yard touchdown and one-on-ones from Garrett Nussmeyer. Uh, Kamorian Pimpton, a freshman tight end who looked really impressive, made a great back shoulder adjustment for a catch. Aaron Anderson looked explosive in his first practice with LSU. Malik Neighbors made a few grabs. Brian Kelly said to take this with a grain of salt, though, because this is the first practice, and right now at this point, they're not so much focused on who's winning and losing these reps, but the technique in, within them. Um, so they definitely have some work to do at corner. Um, the first ones we saw out there were Deuce Chestnut and Zai Alexander, but LSU continued to rotate, and that'll be the position to watch throughout camp and see how that unfolds. Thanks for watching, everybody. This has been Wilson Alexander with your LSU update.